time for some out of the bus stretches. Show me your dance. Another long car ride today, but nothing can stop this girl because she's a champ. This is my family, and we are living Asian. Oh, no. oh. Oh. You're not a of me. <laughs> okay, so we're at this place that really kind of embraces the traditional Mongolian culture, and they've also really innovated and made an awesome farm. First, the welcome ceremony was to make us drink, let us drink cow's milk. Cow's no, milk? I'm sorry, horse's milk. That's hard to even say. Which was uh, interesting, surprising. So put it on that finger and then flick it to the side. <laughs> is it yogurt or what is it? <laughs> now up to this guy. Mm -hmm. This is my head. Mm -hmm. And a little sip. Okay. <laughs> 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 that is sour. Make that sour. I can't control my face. Yeah, you really should stop making that jacket sound. I didn't. It was a sour sound. Don't be mean. It's horse milk. Just a mana. <laughs> wow. They say, it's really good for your health. Okay. What they told me is if you drink this for a month, you never have to worry about your stomach health again. I don't like I don't know. <laughs> That's a sheet, me? Yeah, that's the whole sheet. What do you think about that? They cook the sheet. Yeah, how do you feel? Well, when you're done with the head, you see the skull. <laughs> He died it? They died it? Mm, yeah, they killed it. Did you Why? know that that's what happens? That's how we eat meat? <laughs> I'm not eating it. <laughs> what about you, Brandon? <laughs> I'll eat it. It just is, it, it does make me feel a little sad. The presentation is a little bit. <laughs> you know, not hiding anything. <laughs> So I think this is like the party secretary of this area and he's going to start a little ceremony, traditional ceremony.
So they said that if you come to this village area, you have to eat the sheep, so. What happens if you don't? I don't know, but I don't want to find out. <laughs> so I will be eating the sheep. I don't know if we're going to get the kids to do it. Power. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm oh, and we love cake. Mm. Mm. That's really good. <laughs> it is good because you don't usually love sheep. Mm -hmm. It's actually super good. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Now we know. Okay. I'm I am gonna stick with the uh, the meat portion because I don't know if I can get that much fat. It's not as high. Mom, I think and then. You can't yeah. Actually, as far as as far as sheep goes, it's like it tastes really fresh. It doesn't have like I mean, you can taste the sheep for sure, but it's really good. <laughs> okay, so this moon cake is I mean, we've had a lot of moon cakes. This one's made with milk, and it tastes like cheesecake. Like, I've never really had anything like this in China. <laughs> It's really So this is a traditional Inner Mongolian house and they said that like four or five people can live in this thing. It's pretty crazy. It's kind of warm in here. Right? I wonder if this opens better. Oh, it's like, it is open. I love it, look at this. <laughs> Look at that TV. I feel like I'm being like transported back in time. <laughs> but look, there's like blankets. People are yeah, living here. I think so. Check out this door. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what it tastes like. It tastes like um, strawberry ice cream. Is it a little more sour than what you're used to? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And tell me again what it's made from? Horse milk. Okay, so like it tastes good, but I mean I definitely like it. Ice cream. Yeah. So why do you think they're pushing it so much? Well, the whole like 
marketing thing they have going is that it's it's more nutritious. That they've that they have like these high end superior processes and just in general that, that horses milk has better nutrients than cow's milk. I don't know anything about this. So we'll have to like check it out later but that's the me- that's the message. Yeah. <laughs> You like it? No. Oh, you don't like it? I did not know that you can milk a cow. Milk a cow? Mm-hmm. I mean, milk a horse. You know me either. Oh my goodness. Together, together. Hey, I need to go to bed. Oh, you need to take your shoes off, princess. Okay. Holy crap. It's an interesting bathroom. Whoa. <laughs> just open. Whoa. It's just an open bathroom, so you just shower. Whoa. Looks like, remember all those wow. houses we looked at that were decorated like this? Yeah, this we should like have done fair. this for Winnie. <laughs> like Donald Trump's bathroom. What are you doing? Just doing some work? Look at Winnie doing her work. That's a fridge, but good try. Please. Should we go home? Yes. First needs, let's go home. <laughs> Did everyone have a good trip? Yeah. Say woo! Say goodbye, Inner Mongolia. Bye bye, Inner Mongolia. Say goodbye. What did you do, Winnie? Get her mask on. You got the horsey's mask on. Good job. You're such a good horse, mommy. I know. <laughs> You're cute. Hi. Here we go. Wow. That's cute. We did it. That is something. It was. Uh, Better than expected, honestly, with the kids. And just in general, I thought it was a, it was a really cool trip. Mm-hmm. Worth it. Well, we can now say that we've traveled for a week in a tour bus with a tour group with two little kids, and they nailed it. They did so good. You know, of course, we had our random meltdowns, but those are to be expected, and they were short lived. So proud of you, girls. So, so proud. And so glad to be in the humid Qingdao weather. Oh, it just feels so much better. Welcome home. And we're happy to be reunited with Tony. The girls missed him so much. Make sure to like and subscribe.